What we have here is a box. Inside this box is a ASUS motherboard, RAM, and an ATI graphics card. I bought this from Newegg. This is going to be part, these are components for my first ever PC build. I'm doing unboxing videos for every component. So if you want to check out the other videos I have, go right ahead, check them out. I'm, like I said, I'm doing an unboxing for every component and I'm doing a video for the actual build of the PC itself. So I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, some of the components I purchased were from Newegg, like these components. Some of the components I purchased from Tiger Direct. Some I purchased from Amazon. And I actually got a keyboard at BJ's. So everything's ready to go. Let's get started. All right. All right, opening it up, and as you can see, the first thing you'll see is the motherboard. The motherboard is made by ASUS. It's a Crosshair 4 formula motherboard designed for gamers. It's a Republic of Gamers motherboard, and uh, I'm not a huge gamer, uh, but I will be doing some gaming on this new PC, and I mainly bought this uh, because it's a good motherboard, and I'm going to be doing a lot of video editing with this machine primarily, but I will be doing some gaming. So let's pull that out right now. There's that box. We'll get into that in a second. Next thing up. is my RAM. This is uh, Corsair. It's uh, eight gigabytes of RAM. There's four gigabytes per box. There's two boxes in here. And uh, there's two, two modules each. So there's actually four modules, two gigabytes a piece. And uh, I'll show you that in a second. And finally, My graphics card. It's an ATI Radeon graphics card. Um, it's made by Seuss. It's the EAH5830. One gigabyte GDDR5. So we're gonna unbox that in a second. So, we are gonna start off with the RAM. All right, this is the RAM I'm using for my PC build here. It's got a nice bubble wrap here. All right, open this up. Try and keep it intact a little bit because I actually do a lot of uh, shipping. So, not a whole lot of shipping, but some shipping, and I like to get packaging. But anyway, this is the RAM. It's Corsair XMS3, and these are DDR3 RAM. Now, there's two per box. Each box is four gigabytes, so each is two gigabytes. Total, I have eight gigs here for my, my build. And we're gonna open that up real quick. Just give you a little look-see in what's inside. Slice that open. It's gonna be pretty straightforward, but I'll show you anyway. My, my motherboard has four slots, and uh, as you know, they have to come in pairs. Um, if they're pairs, or sometimes they come in, in threes. In this case, they come in pairs, and there we go. There's the pair of RAM, and the box is actually configured so you could do three, as you know. Uh, three is a new thing now, but uh, I'm just using the two. And the board has four slots, uh, so I will be using all four slots on it. 
So that is that. The second box is going to be the same. I just want to give you an idea of what's inside of here, and we're doing an unboxing. All right, this is an unboxing video for the ASUS Crosshair 4 Formula motherboard. It's designed for gamers. It's a Republic of Gamers motherboard. Um, it's an AMD motherboard with uh, AM3 socket support and uh, you can use Crossfire on it. I won't be using that at this time. Uh, there's a little Velcro here. I'm just going to give you a quick view of the motherboard through the window here. And it's a pretty sleek looking board and uh, it's a gaming motherboard basically and it's built for overclocking and actually has the buttons on there to overclock it but uh, if you've sought this out you probably know that already all right on the bullet points up here it says gamers wants and needs rog connect plug and overclock tweak it the hardcore way game first the speed you need to pwn memory okay any memory is okay and it has supreme effects x built-in, listen with absolute HD play in extreme fidelity. So this is a good board, especially for my needs. It's going to be definitely sufficient. This board is made to be overclocked, and maybe I'll make a video on that at a later date, but right now we're just focusing on the unboxing and the actual build of this PC. Up top here, you got a little carry handle, carrying handle which is cool, so I can get it back in, and we're going to open this up right now. If you can see this, maybe i got to pull it back just a hair. All right, I'm going to open this up and pull this out. In the box, that's pretty much it. Nothing else in the box. And like I said, it's a pretty slick looking board here. And I'm really not going to touch it here, but there you go. See the socket here. And I'm going to be liquid cooling this with a uh, Corsair H70. And of course over here you see the four um, slots for the RAM. And uh, let's open up the bottom part of this. You get a USB cord, zip ties, crossfire bridge, connectors, back cover, user guide, CD, and it actually has a little badge in there, Republic of Gamers badge, which is cool. Ah, more connectors back here. This is uh, a SATA port and US two USBs. Uh, more cords. And looks like a decal here. Republic of Gamers decal. So that is what you can expect to see if you do purchase this motherboard. The next time you see it, I will be installing it in my PC build. So until next time, I'll see you then.